I got a PhD in applied mathematics and especially to underwater acoustics. Usually when people ask me what I do, I just tell them that I count fish. Hi, I'm Johan and um, I come from France and um, I'm now a fishery scientist for NIWA in Wellington. We are doing research um, in fisheries, in oceanography, with a forecast as well. I first thought about New Zealand quite young just because I've always been sailing and New Zealand is a big sailing nation. When they advertised for the job at the end of my PhD, it was just the perfect time, so I just applied for it and uh, luckily I got it, so I decided that it would be a great opportunity to see what my teenage dream was and if it was actually worth it. I'm working in quite a narrow field and I wanted to expand my horizons as well, uh, scientifically wise, so it wasn't really good to stay in the same institute I, I, I did my PhD in. So uh, moving was kind of a natural step for us. When they offered me the job at NIWA, uh, they asked me to commit to, um, to the position for at least two years to make sure that they were making an investment worth, worth their while because that's the same thing for the company. It's a big move for me, but it's also a big move for a company to provide a job to someone that comes from halfway around the world. The people that we're employing really want to come to New Zealand. They like the lifestyle, um, they coming often have identified NIWA as a potential employer in terms of the scientific work that we do. And in, specifically in Johan's case, with his windsurfing and his sailing, Wellington's been a fantastic place for him and um, really enjoying the environment here in Wellington. The windsurfing in Wellington is definitely better than anywhere else just because it's the windiest city in the world, so that's, that's, that's solid. My van is permanently full of gear. I'm not a great windsurfer, but uh, uh, I'm good enough that I enjoy Wellington very much for that as well. So I spend a lot of time at sea as well. Uh, so for instance, over the past year, I've spent more than 20 weeks at sea. That takes a lot of my time, but in return, you get your weekend back. Usually, Niwa does uh, Antarctic trips about once every three years, as far down as Terra Nova Bay, which is a bit further south the Ross Sea. That was a great experience as well. Uh, uh, we spent four weeks just following blue waves. We found this place in Newtown about a year and a half ago, called Little Wooden House, small backyard at the back, quite sunny. One of the surprises we had when we first arrived was the fact that most houses only have single glazed windows, are quite poorly insulated compared to what we were used to. New Zealand is a place with awesome products, like all the veggies are great, uh, the, the, the meat is just beautiful. We've had more trouble with the New Zealand wine at the beginning, but probably because uh, you have to start over and find the good ones again. I don't see myself living in, uh, in the next 10 years. I've got no idea what's going to happen, but at the moment it's just like a, a good place to be, so 